Okay, so here we go. This is the start of the last bit of the distance as I see it, the last six missions. So far we haven't lost anybody. Let's get in there and oh yeah, let's let's keep it really quiet, shall we? We'll totally do that. <laughs> Sasha Mercy Yumiko team is so good always will be yeah I know it's 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 a go-to combo you just uh, just it's just never wrong to sort of take them is it Oof! look at the range on that we're getting both of these exploding walkers what was that about not making any noise whoops oh what was that about not not misclicking I promise that was a that absolute goofy step there was a flipping um, misclick, mistap, whatever whatever the whatever the alternative is when you're on a phone. Let's get you guys cooking. Let's do this to cripple him, and then we can get out of the way. Because of course we are hitting multiple targets, movement options that you can you can present yourself when it's uh, assault Rosita. Just always pretty impressive. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get you cooking, or not. Okay, I wanted at least somebody to be fully charged, and somebody was. Beautiful, loving your work. Yeah, I mean Connie's Connie's damage bonus is definitely something to consider. I mean, you'd you'd, you'd kind of be a bit like, hmm, well, okay, but I mean, it's it's a significant damage boost. Considering that you some have some characters, and that is their leadership trait, that is their, you know, their special thing. Um, but she does it. She does it better than than some characters whose whose USP is damage boosting. She she does that plus she gives you charge points. Pretty nuts. Yeah, have her fully upgraded. Make sure that she's got the best perks. I mean, you know, the the drill you kind of want. Lucky. Uh, ruthless, obviously. I mean, strong is a good one. Weaken. Perseverance, you know, to, to give you those extra chances at charge points. Whatever, whatever you fancy. Beth is decent for a scout also. I mean, yes, yeah, I, I know that some people just, you know, really can work her very, very well. Uh, for me, though, you're, you're talking about a class where you've got Connie, Outlaw Negan, S Survivalist Rick, if you want an Alpha Strike, Huntsman Daryl, if... You know, you just want to have that that fun with him, basically. But yes, yeah, I I mean, I've got to um, maybe I've got to use Beth more. She was absolutely hands down one of my favourite characters in the show. Heartbroken when she got killed, so ignominiously as well. Um, yeah, I know some people really can use her in this game as well. I just, I guess, I haven't just, just haven't paid that much attention to her. Been neglecting her. Make it sound like marriage counselling. Hey, Leroy, how are you doing? Where are you? Like, what the hell was that? <laughs> okay, Leroy, time to put you to bed now. Rosita, Beth, and Tyrese, great team. 
Yeah, I mean, I like the idea of Beth and Tyrese working together. So you've got the, the, the two sort of debuff circles kind of working in tandem. I think that's that's nice. It's like, you know, it's like poetry. It rhymes. Um, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I like the fact there are multiple combos that you can use. This, so these guys are real keen. Okay, so let's take out the raiders. So that's what the focus is here. So let's um, get the right gear. Yeah, Megagi, Shane, I think that that's absolutely fine. Um, Yeah, Aaron, I think that you take... Oh, no, I have been upgrading the... Look, there it is. There's a the nail gun. Bear with just a second for this brief interlude. Thanks for reminding me, guys. What a perfect timing, huh? Okay, okay, let's, let's dive back in. Let's... Nail them. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we've got... Doesn't generate... I mean, it does not generate threat. That is something that's actually quite big. It's got interrupts. Charge attack is a free attack, which roots the target as well. I mean... I've seen this compared to... The Savior's handgun, but frankly, it's got it's got more special rules. It seems seems better than the Savior's handgun, and I feel dirty saying that. But <laughs> I love the fact that they make the wrong noises. Okay, let's get you cooking. Good looking. You already are. Yeah, I wanted that guy out of there because he had a, a ranged weapon. Oh, Chad, man. I'm feeling... Almost feeling sorry for you. You are facing a flipping firing line right here. Oh, no, you can't... You can't move. Oh, Chad... Ah, oh, screw it. Damn it. Should move past Chad the Chump, shouldn't we? Um, hmm. Okay, I was hoping to blow that guy up, but that didn't happen. Um... Okay, I blocked myself in. That's not a very smart thing to do. Good old sure shot doing what sure shot does. And this was this is I made a bit of a mistake here. I, I really will admit it. Um, I need to kind of like be careful with this. I need them wounded more severely. I need Shane to blow these up. Oh my god, Shane. I was, I was going for Shane just sort of like blowing those guys up, basically. That's kind of what I needed to happen there. Well, yeah, I mean, that's that's kind of what we're going for. I'm going to be upset if we don't, so... I think Shane, one way or another, is getting chewed on. Oh, no. Okay, what have we got? We've got two turns until... Reinforcements arrive. Let's do this. Get rid of them. Bit of a gamble that, but I think it was worth it. Right, none of you can reach anybody, so we don't need to worry about you, do we? Okay, that... 
sort of helps. Ish. But Shane, of course, is right next to that guy. Okay, so we didn't kill our friend there, so Shane's going to get chewed on. But getting chewed on is not the same as being killed. So, I mean, we didn't get through unscathed. Shane got damaged, and that was just me. That was pure hubris. I was there flipping, picking on that uh, that survivor, whatever his name was. 